What's up, guys? Nepenthes here, and welcome back. Wait, did what did I say? Team of the season verified. What? Did, what's that little bar across the bottom? That's new. Team of the season verified. Team of the season rewards. Oh, this is what we're talking about. During team of the season, we'll be updating rewards in champions S squad battles. Squad battles. <laughs> <sighs> My life is complete. New rewards starting on April 19th for champs, 21st for squad battles, and 25th for the division rivals. Check out the reward section of each mode over the coming days to see the updated rewards for each mode and rank. During team of the season, the champions' final events start will be delayed until 8 p.m. BST and extended by 24 hours to ensure rewards can feature team of the season items from that weekend's Friday squad release. Plus, to celebrate the start of team of the season this week, You've been given enough champs qualification points to enter champions playoffs and play to qualify for the champions finals. Awesome. Like the only thing I think the only thing I'm hopeful for is that it's not that carbon copy of what we had last year with squad battles where you just get like a red pick like max 89 and stuff unless you get into the top 200. Just, like, actually put some effort into the new rewards please EA. People would be delighted if you want to be able to afford the best players and open the best packs in fc24 go to u7buy.com to buy your eafc24 coins it's cheaper than buying fc points and just as reliable they already offer some of the best prices out there but you can get an extra six percent off using promo code nep at checkout and with that let us see what we have got please Team of the season warm up cup. Come on. That's what we've been waiting for. Oh, it's an 84 by 5 for the group reward. Play 1 for an 85 by 5. Play 5 for an 83 by 2. 10 for an 83 by 3. Win 2 for a Premier League Prime Players Pack. Love that. 4 for a Bundesliga. 6 for a La Liga. 8 for a League 1. And 10 for a Serie A pack. How does the cup work? Unlimited games. Mystery ball. Oh, wow. Wait, team overall rating max 93. 94 and higher overall players, max zero. Lone players, back. you might as well have no requirements. <laughs> what? That is absolutely pointless. Who's sitting here rocking like multiple 95, 94, 96 rated cards? Almost no one. What's mystery ball? Mystery ball is where every time, uh, every time the ball goes out of play, a new feature comes into the game. Like... Like like insane speed, or like if you get the shooting one, you basically just press shot shoot in the in your opponent's half, and it just flies into the the back of the net. Um, there, there's about like five or six different things, like power ups. Basically, it's, it is a fun mode. It is a fun mode, and it will be quite hilarious to play it. To be fair, um, in the friendlies, GG's to EA. Um, so there you go. We have finally got the team of the season warm up cup. There for like nine and a half days as well, which is quite nice. In terms of seasonal. Nothing new. Milestones. Nothing new. Uh, evolutions. Come on. Come on. Nope. No evolutions. I thought we'd have like a good week of evos because there's not a lot of other things going on. I thought EA would like bless us with evos. And then we've got... Do we have a new player? Or some new players? Maya Trossard, Chengiz Under, Van de Ven, Dis Melu, Florenzi, Ginou La La, Rodrigo Melu, Muniz. Damn, no new players. Okay. Uh, daily login. Oh, do you know what? I already forgot that one day now. I didn't do it yesterday. I didn't do it yesterday. I wonder, have, have we got like one bonus day of this? Sometimes they give like one extra day of the SBC, don't they? So for people that miss out one day, they can still do it. I forgot to do it yesterday. Oh, 85 player picks back. Three per day. How, what was that? Three per day. Every day, four, four days. So you could get 20, 20 of these. No, 12 of these altogether. This is going to be an 84A squad. Oh. This is one of those ones, guys, where it might be worth holding these Friday. I know it would mean that you can't open any more packs. But if you can get yourself into a position where you can cover off enough fodder for the 83 by 10s, the 82 by 11s, and these uh, player picks as well, 
it really could be worth holding them. It really could be worth holding them. Because they're just good. I like these. I like these player picks. One of 385 plus. Obviously now, you've only got like high rate fodder or informs available. Yeah, and there you go. Oh, Penda door. So you get inform or Penda. Uh, which actually isn't even that bad, to be fair, to take like some of the high rate fodder. Um, it's, it's just a like, I don't know, may, maybe Thursday. I would do may, maybe like I'll get everything prepared that I've got enough fodder on Thursday and Friday to do everything. And then I'll save them Thursday and Friday for Friday evening. And so that we'll have uh, six of them for the team of the season. That might be one of those worthwhile things to do. That might be one of those worthwhile things to do. Um, let's build one more, and then we'll see what else, what else we've got, and uh, go check the store as well for today. Hey, right, come on, give me a big, give me a big player, give me a Mbappe team of the week, please. Lucky. Should have taken Harry Kane for the exchange, but uh, Rui Diaz is there. Uh, what else have we got? 83 by 10 is back. 82 by 11 is back again now. So it repeats every two days. I got panicked before. Oh, the 81 player pick is back. I actually didn't think that they would give us a player pick again this week. But they have. And it's there for six days. I tell you what, guys. EA are doing us nice in the menus at the moment. Really nice. The 81 player pick. It's two extra cards compared to the 80 plus. But obviously removes an insane amount of uh, low rated fodder out of the out of the system which is great the fact that it's there during the start of team of the season as well is great and oh that means team of the season live cards are going to be champs reward and um the exchange is still there i'm hoping that the exchange it's a check baby the exchange uh comes straight back once it goes hopefully not the same hopefully either a bit different or just extra um, right, Pedacek, I've been, I've been for my Arsenal RTG, this is banging. I've, I, have I needed him? Jesus Christ. Six foot five, controlled lengthy. S supposedly one of the best goalkeepers in the game. Look at that. You know, you know he's an Arsenal through and through icon when he ended his career at Arsenal. It's just beautiful, isn't it? And didn't he set it? Not even, didn't he? He set the record for the most clean sheets by a Premier League goalkeeper in an Arsenal shirt. Which shows he's an Arsenal icon. Bronze and silver, an 81. An 85 with an inform. An 86 with an inform. An 87 with an inform. An 87 with an inform. An 88. Very easy. Nice. Very easy and nice. Um, I will be completing him. And yeah, so the exchange ends in three days and a bit. So literally on Friday, the exchange ends. I want it to come back, but just have lo loads of other options you know it, at the very least up to like a 93 for the exchange and then you know like i said i've, I've mentioned this a few times before what EA can do is in, instead of doing like a 90 rated overall for like 65 players and a 91 for like 78 players and things like that just do like a 90 rated overall for an 85 by 5 uh 91 for you know an 87 by 4 uh a 91 for you know even like an 88 by 2 something like that um a general team of the season exchange would be great. Yeah, team of the season for like an 83 by 10, something like that. Like there is a lot that they can do with the exchange. There is a lot they can do with it. Um, and then into the store. Um, for out. Global limit packs. Enco. They're going back. Come on. Go on. Give me Mbappe. Imagine. Um, what else is promo packet? Just that what the epic historical encore pack? Man, the names are crazy, aren't they? Four guaranteed winter wildcard icons, ready for Champions League heroes or future stars icons, with one guaranteed to be eighty nine or higher. Also, 35 rare gold player items rated 81 or higher. I feel like this is an awful, awful pack. Because there aren't many icons there that are good. Yeah, 
you've got a 62% chance of a future stars icon, 59% chance of a winter wildcard icon, 53% chance of an inform, 96% chance of a UEFA team of the year men's player, 25% chance of a UEFA team of the year women's player. I'll, I'll rip this. I genuinely think this is going to be a horrific pack. Prove me wrong, EA. Prove me wrong. Crespo, isn't it? Pretty sure it's Crespo. And Poyo, yeah. That doesn't mean there can't still be like a Zidane in here. Nah, this is bobbins. It, oh, this is bobbins. Do not under any circumstance open this pack. Do not do it. It is a literal scam. Like this, you got what what it said you'd get. It's a scam. For seven hundred fifty thousand coins, man. I don't even know if there's many icons from Future Stars or whatever that are are, are, are good enough in that regard. So we've got Pedacek SBC. Marky match oh marky matchups for a prime gold players pack. Always, always nice, always worth doing. A5 plus player pick I like. A1 plus player pick I like. Petter check I like. Um the new objective I like. The warm-up cup I like. Uh the fact that it's unlimited games as well is really nice. People could just go and get that done. Very nice. In 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 mystery ball as well, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Um No Evolutions is a bit of a pain. But yeah, that pack, um, we want, how do we select card type here? Rarity. Future Stars icons. You've got Zidane, Ronaldinho, Maldini, Zico. Are pretty much the only icons that would be worth getting from Future Stars. Everything else is terrible, but... What are the odds you're going to get one of those? Like maybe you'd sell for Roberto Carlos as well, but he was an SBC already, so kind of pointless. Um, what was the other icon type? What was the other card type? What was the other icon? I can't remember what the other icon type was. It was that bad. Oh, winter. Oh, winter wild. Oh, Jesus Christ. Winter. Yeah. Winter wild card icon. Pele would be good, obviously. And that's literally it. Yashin's okay, but he's had an SBC. Grinch is okay. Yeah, that is... That is an awful, awful SBC. Sorry, pack, not SBC, I beg your pardon. Awful. Um, and then obviously there was a, a few of the UCL cards and stuff, but again, you're looking at like maybe one, maybe two players that are worthwhile. So don't touch the store packs, guys. Go get your SBCs in because they're sick. Go get your pet check because he's sick. Go and get your uh, packs from the. You know, do you know what's a bit like? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna be picky here. I'm not blown away by this. I like the fact that the things I like about it, unlimited games don't have to be resorted to one day. Mystery ball is a bag of fun. And at the very least, the uh, objective, like the team requirements, restrict like high level team of the years and icons and stuff like that. That's calm, right? Fun. The packs in return, just a bit mid, aren't they? It is just a bit mid. An 80 by five, who cares? You get that for playing three games in a day. 83 by threes are so, so basic. The prime player packs from the specific leagues are decent. But we will get those as SBC repeatables anyway. Um, yeah, like I'm, I am being overly picky at this point. I do get it. Like it is almost like picking for the sake of picking. But it's like this cup isn't something that like I'm not like, oh, my God, let me go and play this straight away. Get this like taken care of. This is like a, OK, that's cool. That's all right. You know, that's all right. But anyway, um, yeah, if it's fun to play, that'd be a lot better. For those of you that haven't got level 40 yet either, there's a thousand XP in there, which is good. But that is going to be the end for today. So if you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like rating, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.